Okay, welcome back to more Let's Play Lufia and the Fortress of Doom. In the last one, we were in another cave, woohoo, and um, we're up to five Illumina, and uh, I found this guy. Actually, I already talked to him, because uh, he ran back to find his, uh, find his wife. Uh, he was in such a hurry to uh, to lose half his shit that he, uh, he ran right back to the place to get married. Uh, thanks for saving me. Did you find your Illumina? See, I'm not, I don't know which place is which, but the fact that they're saying four, and then he gave me one, so that's five, so I think I got them all. Uh, but what he said, what's important, is that he said, I heard King Herod has been hoarding Illumina lately. Herod is up the river that's west of town, which is left. Uh, the only way to get there is by ship. Okay, so that's where we have to go. I thought about going to the tower... Because uh, I came across the tower, but I wasn't at full, um, I wasn't at full HP. I was under 100 magic. So I just looked around, and, uh, the tower was, like, right there. Uh, so the town was nearby, so I went ahead and, uh, stayed at the inn. And, uh, just talked, and then just ran into that person. So, um, so we actually got a tip to go to another place. Um, we're probably gonna have to go up the tower. I mean, obviously, we're gonna have to go up the tower at some point, but... But, uh, let's put it off for now. We have a better, um... Learn mirror. Okay, cool. Uh, we actually have a better, uh, lead, uh, than that. It said up the river, west of town, can only get there by ship. I'm assuming it's this place. Okay. I'm seeing a uh, mountain on either side, so I'm guessing that, um, that that means that we're gonna have to, uh, to, to like, squirm down in that little crevice. Um, yeah, there was another river that you can go, that you can, like, sort of follow, but it just leads to a bridge. And you can't go into the bridge, uh, you just exit the ship, which I always thought was corny. Uh, like a corny thing they do in games. Ah, here we go, look at that, a castle in an enclosed, uh, space. Uh, okay, let's go ahead. And just fuck these dudes up. <clears throat> I did do a once-over of, um, of that dungeon. I couldn't find anything else, so I didn't want to spend too much time there, so, um, I didn't explore it as thoroughly as the other place. I'm pretty sure we got... I'm trying to think. Do we actually go everywhere in that cave? I I think we did. The only reason I spent so much time in that other cave is because I could see I could like see a thing. Maybe something somewhere else in the world will just warp you to it or something. From like other side of the from like another side of the world or something, who knows? Oh I did stock up. I bought like a fuckload of uh smoke balls. Uh yeah, I bought ninety-nine plus twenty-two, or that's how many I have now anyway. Um no, I think we're good on items. Uh, and I sold my old shit. Oh, they sell the Buster Sword now. Okay, let's, um... Look, just make sure... Okay, man, see, I got so much damn money. Okay, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, definitely do that. And, um... It's already better... Well, I guess that's the only thing that, uh, that we uh, have that we can buy. Okay, let's go ahead and put that on. I guess I could have checked the uh, armor shop and then gone to the menu once, but whatever. Um... Okay, you're the... I mean... What can I do for you today? Okay, I had a feeling you were that person, but you didn't have the stained glass windows, so I wasn't uh, entirely sure. The king has many jewels. He's been collecting Illumina lately. Uh, am I just gonna get one? Is he gonna be like, I'll give you one, but I wanna keep one. Does he only have two? I think I need... I think I need, um... I just stayed at the inn a minute ago. Plum Cider? I haven't seen that in forever. It's probably not... It's probably super outdated by now. Um, I think I need two more, so hopefully he gives me two. Okay, just the armor shop inside a little, uh, hole in the cave side, cliff side or whatever. Do you know about dragon eggs? I know that I have some. I don't know what they do. Take eight dragon eggs to the small shrine west of here, and your wishes will be granted. After that, the eggs scatter to treasure boxes around the world. Oh my gosh, it's like Dragon Balls? Are you freaking kidding me? Did I read that right? Oh, that probably is a reference to Dragon Balls, because they both have dragon in it, and they're like roundish objects. Small shrine west of here. Oh, that's such bull honk. How many do I have? I, I have a lot. I have eight. Is that all of them? That can't be all of them, right? I haven't been to all the places in the world. Uh, basement armor shop. Technically, you're on, like, the ground floor. Oh, damn it. Boy, we got a lot of shit. 
Um, okay, so that's 10,000 for four. I feel like that's sort of not worth it. Three and three. Tower shield is already outdated. Uh, silver armor is... We already have that. Uh, okay, we have that too. We have the silver wrist. Um, silver helmet gives four to you. Two to you. I mean, I've got the money. Should I just... Let's start with shoes, since I haven't bought new shoes for uh, some of the people in a while. Uh, I actually have already come across those. Why don't I have better shoes yet? Jeez. Uh, okay, I think I have knife shoes on, those two people. See, eight agility for one defense? See, I can maybe live with that one. Um... Am I gonna need it? Should I... I don't like giving up defense, but it's only one point for eight agility. That kind of, that seems worth it. Let's do it. Plus, I've just had those stupid tan shoes on for freaking ever. Uh, and then, you know, 6,200 for... Actually... Okay, we just have the two helmets. I don't know. Sure, why not? I got the Muns. And, uh... Buy a silver helmet for, uh, for Mr. Tom. And then... Okay, we don't need that. I mean, we got money. I mean, we might as well... I mean... Uh, I don't know. There's always that part that's like, oh, might as well... Oh, wait, I could put a tower shield on Arugula. Why doesn't he have a tower shield on? I, f I found two. Uh, let's buy two of these. And... I guess two of these. We'll save the rest of the money. Alright, uh... Now, what the... Oh, why can't he put a tower shield on? Was the silver plate better, and I just didn't see it? I must have not looked at something correctly. Or did I only find... Or did I only find one? Hold on. Oh, I... I must have only found one. Let me just look. I guess I only found one. Okay, well, fuck it. Yeah, I'll buy another one of those then. Okay, uh, actually, let's cut for just a sec while I equip everything, and, uh, we'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Uh, did I talk to you? Oh, I did. Damn it. <laughs> it was so long ago, I already forgot that I talked to that guy. Okay, so west of town to get a... to... Huh. So I guess this would be confusing if you didn't go to the cave, uh, first. What's the point of this empty place, though? I don't know. It was weird. I was uh, equipping shit, and all of a sudden it just didn't let me equip it. It was like, you have too many things. It's like, I haven't gained any items, so how, how did I run out of shit midway through equipping shit? Um, but as it turns out, um, I guess I must have been equipping shit that was, like, stacking on other shit, and then I equipped something, and then there just wasn't a place for it. It was weird. Uh, the king's a famous gourmet. He's been unhappy lately because he can't get anything good to eat. Oh shit, he's, he's gonna be like, go to the tower and bring me a thing and then I'll share my Illumina with you. Fucking, that would be so cliche. Um, so like, such an obvious problem since they like, put that in there. Rod? Apron? What the hell? Um, guessing I could just, I should just go sell that now. I heard that a purple newt lives in a cave east of town. They say some food's... I uh, really need a flavor of a purple newt. A cook from Leiden was looking for it. Okay, that's probably a clue also. So we gotta go... He didn't find one, so we returned to Leiden. So that one said... Cave east of town. So I'm probably gonna have to go around... Uh, since I'm in the little enclosed area or whatever. Oh man, we got a castle too. Alright. Actually, the castles don't usually take that long to explore. Let me just check for potions. Yeah, sometimes uh, you run into a castle in a video game and you're just like, Ugh! I can't wait to spend a half hour roaming around here. You're strangers around here, aren't you? Uh, don't fucking worry about it, eh? Yeah, east of town. I guess I could just get out of my boat and just check. I don't have to go, like, too far. Okay, check for hidden side doors. Alright, cool. I'm just sleeping on the job, standing up. What are you, from Metal Gear? 
Okay, then you're gonna wake up and say that you feel asleep and confuse the shit out of six-year-old me. <laughs> um, like, why would you feel asleep and then wake up? The whole concept of a typo hadn't occurred to me. I just assumed that adults just never make spelling mistakes. Boy, was I fucking wrong. <laughs> uh, the king really likes collecting Illumina. My ring is made of Illumina, too. Isn't it beautiful? Uh, hey, I might need to murder you, because I need your fucking shit. I need that. Uh, a chef from Leiden was here recently. He talked on and on about purple newts. So I'm gonna have to get that fucking newt at some point. It's time to prepare dinner. Oh, always so busy. And, well, I guess back, in all fairness, back in the day, you were actually, like, preparing this shit from scratch. It's not like, you know, stick it in the microwave, hit the button. All the electronic appliances, it's always just like putting something in something and then hitting a button. Uh, same with, uh, like, uh, like laundry. I think, um, yeah, Bill Burb did a joke about this or whatever. He's like, laundry is the most overrated fucking, his appetite has gone too far, it takes so much to feed him. Um... It's like such an overrated chore. Like people are like, "Oh, laundry! Oh my God, it's so overwhelming! It's a mountain! It never laundry never ends." I'm like, you put it in the thing and you hit the button and then you walk away for an hour. Jeez, you young lady, would you taste this, please? Oh wow, delicious but strange. Mm, what is it? Strange slime. Slime. Oh yuck! Don't let people eat this. Why would a professional uh, chef create like concoct a dish with slime? Hey, Slime Elf, how was it? Ha ha ha! Slime Elf, do you think I ate this on purpose? Oh, Tom. Well, you did eat it on purpose, technically. Arugula, you hurt Jiren's feelings. How could... Oh, come the fuck on. Boo fucking who. Grow the fuck up. That was like the tamest joke to hurt someone's feelings. You can just get the fuck over it. Just a little joke. That's all a joke. You know, the things that you're not supposed to take seriously, but apparently not everybody got the fucking memo. Uh, Jiren, no one will call you a Slime Elf anymore. Oh, I know, Tom. Yeah, Slime Elf! All right, <laughs> Luffy, yeah, that's actually funny. <laughs> you said words, and you're affecting my emotional state with your words. Yeah, because that's a good way to live your life, right? Um, I just want, I want everyone to always be put, I want myself to be in a position where I never have to deal with anything I don't want to deal with, even if it's, like, tame. Um, you always pay attention to Jiren. Why don't you ever notice me? Uh, cause you haven't hopped on this dick in a hot minute. It's not poison, you won't die if you eat it, you know? Why are you cooking with slime anyway? Yeah, that was my original question. The king loves good food, but he's been really picky recently. It's really starting to annoy me. What, so the slime comes first, and then if he doesn't stop annoying you, it's like, well, looks like we have to move on to poison. Uh, why would I know of any good ingredients that a fucking chef wouldn't know? You would think they would be on top of the in good ingredients that are in the world more than random me. Oops, I meant to... Wait, did I talk to this person? I did. Oh yeah, you're the one that's on my list of people that I need to murder later. Uh, okay. We're getting the worst meals lately. We want our regular fare. Or we're spending all the food budget on the king, durr. Is that an empty chest? Power potion, okay. That's the HP one, okay, I finally remember that. Perhaps the only way to please the king is to taste, to see Leiden's wizard of taste. Oh, for a second I was supposed to say, how the fuck am I gonna remember where that is? But it said Leiden, man. So I gotta go to Leiden, the, that's the chef town, right? I don't think I've ever played a video game where there's just a, sh a town of chefs, like that's what the town is known for. Um, okay, so I was already here. Okay, so let's go back. Wait, where do they find all these, like, blue and, like, green rocks to, uh, to build the castle? Just imagine them, like, mining for, like, the rocks, and they're just like, well, we can't make the castle any bigger. We ran out of floor rocks. Um. Anything up here? No. Up the other side. I don't think so, but... Oh, I never went back to that um, that one castle and checked up the side for those potions that I saw when I was watching that, um, when I had to look up... When I had to look up uh, something in somebody else's Let's Play. Or it was a walkthrough. There wasn't any commentary. Uh, you need very special food to satisfy my father. Is that so? Recently I've eaten... Uh, everything I've eaten recently tastes terrible. I'd give my jewels for some delicious food. Uh, which jewels are you talking about, sir? 
Great, so we actually have to, he didn't explicitly send me on the quest, but there's been enough people uh, hinting at it that I have to probably go back to Leiden. Also, how do I get out of here? Okay. Okay, so let's, uh, hmm, should I check the cave to the east? Uh, also, did I talk to these guards? They're probably just like, welcome to the fucking castle. Uh, straight ahead, alright. Castle is straight ahead. You know, the big fucking castle right in front of you? It's straight ahead. In case you didn't fucking notice. In case you didn't notice the big fucking castle here. Boy. It's your job to just stand there and say obvious shit to morons. Hey, that's what I did uh, when I worked at Taco Bell. Like, what, what, what comes in a chili cheese burrito? Uh, chili and cheese. And my nuts if you don't hurry the fuck up in order. Jeez. Um, I guess I meant, I meant my, my nuts would be placed in his burrito and then removed. I'm not just gonna actually put my testicles in someone's burrito. Nope, not for eight bucks an hour. I ain't chopping them off for, for that little amount. Man, when I worked at Taco Bell, there was a guy, it was, I worked, uh, the one, that, the first one that I worked at in Illinois, uh, there was a guy who was like, I mean, he maybe changed his mind, or, I mean, I'm assuming he didn't do it, but, uh, he had heard that you could, uh, you can, like, sell one of your testicles for, like, $30,000, and he was, uh, he was on board, he was, he was like, I'll totally fucking do it, man. I was like, really? He's like, yeah, I've, once I figure out how to do it, I'm gonna fuck, I'm fucking doing it, man. That's like, I guess it's one thing to say you would do it, but, like, when it really comes down to it, you know, when the doctor's, like, getting ready to put that sleep mask on you, and you reach down and you have two testicles, and you're like, uh, the next time I reach down, it's only gonna be one testicle. I don't know if I could... I don't know, man. How much would it cost? If you would, if you would sell one of your testicles for money, uh, like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah, how much would it, like, for me, how much would it cost for me to legitimately sell a testicle? I, I don't know, man. I think if you get one removed, they, um, they replace it with, like, a silicon testicle. That way you at least have something in there. But it's not the same, man, because you don't have, like, the, the cord that keeps them in the, that keeps them, like, in the same place. Like, your left nut's always on your, on the left, and your right nut's always on the right. I wonder if, like, ladies ever wonder if it's possible for, like, men to get, like, their balls, like, twisted inside their scrotum, where, like, the cords would get, like, all, like, tangled up or whatever, or, like, you know, twisted up. Um, yeah, that, that thought has uh, occurred to me, but for some reason it just never happened, and it's never come close to happening. And I'm sitting here going, like, if it hasn't happened with the amount that I've played with my balls so far, it probably can't happen for some reason. Also, why didn't I kill the werefrog first? I'm a fucking idiot. I saw the group, and I'm just like, oh, always go for the groups. Okay, hopefully I can kill him before he fucks Jiren up. Oh, damn it, Tom. I mean, I can't be mad. That was my fault. Uh, okay, boost. We got full, uh, shit. I also have to try mirror. You know what, let's double boost. Hopefully one of their turns will go first. Actually, I don't even know if, uh, well I guess we'll find out if Flood will actually kill Jiren. Man, it's so fucking strong. Hopefully your magic defense is high enough. Son of a bitch, it was not. Oh, that was my own fucking fault too, damn it. Uh, we're gonna have to run back to a town. Also, I don't know where this damn cave is. Am I in a place where I already, like, was earlier in the game? I don't know. Okay, so let's cut for a sec. I have to let my cat out anyway. He's meowing by the door uh, like a son of a bitch. And, um, yeah, I'm just going to go and uh, bring Jiren back. And we'll meet back at this place. We'll see if we can find this cave. So we'll be right back. Okay, we're back with the same episode of um, Luffy and the Fortress of Doom. Uh, I was hitting the fast forward button to like speed things along and I accidentally hit the F10 button Which is the stop recording button. So this is actually a second uh, recording. I'm just gonna have to smash the two videos together It's not a big deal though. It's pretty easy to do Basically, you just hit import and then you hit one file and then you hit import and then you do the second file And then the cut will appear when one starts and the other begin or one stops and the other begins um, I did check off to the right the right is, uh, takes us back to Mars. I should have known that. I, well, I didn't, I wasn't sure how far to the left I had gone at sea. So I didn't know if there was, like, another landmass between, uh, where I'm at and then the place where Mars is. Uh, so even though we're fighting, um, the, 
like the enemies that we were fighting inside the caves. Um, I like I thought we were fighting like newer enemies to where um, to where it was like a new place or whatever. But apparently it was Mars. Maybe Mars just. I'm pretty sure Mars probably just had the same enemies as inside the caves. I just probably don't remember uh, them being there. Oh, also I might have I might have fought some trolls too, and those get and. Those guys were brand new. Actually, I ran into those uh, later on, but then I, um, but then again, they're not necessarily later, like higher, like next tier enemies, since I could have gotten gone into that other uh, cave first. Uh, anyway, so yeah, so when it said cave to the west, I can see a cave, but I can't, um, I can't reach it. I mean, maybe I could go around the landmass that um, that Mars is on, like go right and then down further, but I didn't feel like doing that. Uh, let, I did want to check to the uh, to the west to see what's up with these uh, Dragon Balls. I'll have to remember to uh, have this only be a shorter or to have this be a shorter uh, recording since it's not technically a new episode. But uh, yeah, I wonder what the wish is going to be. Um, I wish they would sell revives in stores. Would be my wish if I had to pick one. Um, it kind of reminds me of uh, in Link to the Past, where it's like you donate a bunch of rupees and then the fairies like lets you carry more. Uh, either bombs, oh, excuse me, or uh, arrows. That was actually a nice. Uh, what the hell is okay? That was actually um, that was actually nice. You don't really need what the hell. Fucking focus fired on him. Fucking um, that that was like a nice thing. But the fact that it lets you go all the way up to fifty, it's like, did anybody really need fifty bombs? Did anybody real? I mean, arrows. I feel like you'd maybe need a little bit more of like having like. You know, I guess, I don't know, it depends on how much you use them, obviously, but I feel like 50 bombs is, like, way too many, and then 50 arrows is possibly more, is possibly too many, but not as bad as the bombs. Oh, shit, dude. I really don't want to go back to the town. I just started the new episode. Or what, should I? Uh, oh, fuck it. I got, I got 24 of them. Come on, man. Did I really get... Did I forget to heal after the last fight or something? Why did I get... Like, why did I get so effed up? I should have just used... Well, whatever. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I thought the cursor would start out on Tom. Since it's his... Uh, since it's his magic or whatever. I thought that's how it worked. I don't know why I didn't do it that time. But, uh, yeah, I wonder... Like, what could the wish possibly be? Also, why is there a bridge down there? I thought I was supposed to be going to the to the west. Uh, I'm gonna. I kind of want to check left first, just because that was the, physically the direction it said to go. Oh man, boy, they're making. They sure are making you go a long way. They're making you go like all around the fucking world without uh, without an airship or some like. Oh, here's a thing. It's probably right here. Uh, let's kill these guys first. They don't have very much HP. I didn't. I wasn't considering them to be very threatening, but for some reason, I just got totally effed up by them. Maybe Tom was weak to begin with. I don't know. I don't remember. I didn't look, I should say. Uh, yeah, they're sure they're making you go like a long time without, um, not like an airship. Usually, uh, you get it sooner. I mean, it most games make you go like somewhat around the world, but man, without without there being any world map, like I have no sense of like where we've been or like like where are we compared to the beginning of the game? I have no idea. Like, how, how could anyone possibly keep track? This world seems to be freaking huge, too. Because, um, like, the entire game, we're always just going from one place to another, to another, to another, to another, and we're still running into new places. Uh, so, I mean, we have to be, like, almost to where we've explored everywhere, right? And then that's probably where we're going to get the airship, possibly, right? I haven't uh, run into any places where it was, like, super obvious that we needed an airship. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is the dragon dude. I thought we were going to I was like, oh, we got to fight him? But no, this is the dragon dude. Yeah, I forgot. Uh, raise everyone two levels. Um, give me three... Do I get to... Is that three of each of the stat boost potions? Might shield, might bow. Uh, does Might Bow attack everyone? That would be my question. And, uh, I have a feeling only Tom and Arugula could uh, put on the Might Shield. 
So I feel like, um... I would want higher defense on the two ladies. Actually... I think Lufia has gone down the least number of... I think Lufia died a couple times at the beginning, but... It's been Tom and Arugula going down. I mean, Jiren went down a few times when she was, like, lower level. I mean, she's still lower level, but... But, uh... Lately, it's been Tom and Arugula have been dying the most, so the shield might be... Good. Then again, I just spent money on, um... Well, I guess it was just a couple thousand on the tower shield. And then dude's got a better shield than that, I think, doesn't he? Three... Why... Why does this have a squiggle line? Is that called a tilde, I think? Like, how am I supposed to know what that is? If, if I'm gonna... If it's gonna be a situation like this, it should be very clear. Like, see, the other ones are clear. Uh, raising everyone two levels... That does sound nice at first, but, um... But we can just... We can always just grind for that. And, uh, this is on an emulator, so I can just hit fast forward to, uh, to speed up the off, uh, camera battles. I think, uh, does the bow hit everyone? Do, have I been, have I been passing on other bows? Do bows always hit an entire group? Is that the idea behind them? Picking the bow. I just figured that we've had, um, god damn, dude. Placed in different treasure boxes. Wow. If I want... Oh, I thought it said another wishes. I was going to point out a spelling mistake. It's not... Uh, or a grammatical mistake. It's not, though. Not this time. Boy, you... Your wings are, like, clipped or something. Did you used to be somebody's pet? Also, you have, like, no neck. Is that your shoulder? That weird, like, white lump? And also, what is up with your fucking ass? He looks like you're about to prolapse or something. Look at that. Like, the pulsing booty. Uh, okay, well, I guess let's see what we get. Also, I figured that, um, we haven't gotten, I mean, that's 48, I guess. If it's, um, if it hits a group, it'll, I would I would say it's totally worth it. Uh, but we ha we've had the Arteus bow for so long, I figured that, um, that that was, like, the most outdated. That's why I chose it over the shield. Uh, no, I just have two tower shields, but I just found one and I bought the other one. Okay. Um, okay, I guess let's keep exploring. Oh, my Sweetwater ran out when we entered. Let's put that, put another one back on. Oh, I guess a stronger uh, Sweetwater so I don't have to equip it every damn time would be another wish that I would have if I got to pick. Um. Okay, well, let's test it. I waste my wish. Okay, sweet. It does hit both people. It's, uh, I mean, for gaining 40, what was that, 42 attacks, something like that? I feel like the damage boost should have been more. I feel like I should be doing more than, like, 100. Like, I was doing, like, like 80s and 90s, and then it's, like, it's the same. Maybe those guys have higher defense. Maybe I, maybe it would have done less if, uh, if I had the other bow on. I don't know. Yay, Rugula, you go, girl. What's the point of gaining, uh, like, those, are, like, terrible stat boosts? It's like when Jeff gains IQ. Actually, that's not useless. I did kind of wish they would have done, like, more with that. I feel like that was underutilized. Jeff was kind of the, like, the weakest uh, character out of your group in terms of usefulness. Like, if Jeff died, like, nobody really cared. I mean, yeah, it's nice that uh, he can fix things. And he, he does do a couple, like, story things, but they could have just as easily had anybody else do a story thing. It's like having Lufia with us when she opened the magic door. It's like, well, they could have had... They could have just not put that door there, you know. So the fact that he uh, gets the gets the bad key machine, it's like, well, they just put that there to make him seem useful. But in terms of like battle, that you know, that's where a person like a character's importantness or lack thereof is like the most obvious. Uh, all right. I don't know if there's anything else like on this landmass. I guess maybe... Actually, we're almost at an episode. I'll just finish checking this, and then uh, we'll meet... Um, if I can find a way to get to that cave on the east that it mentioned... Or the... the Yeah, the east that it mentioned. What was supposed to be there? I don't remember, actually. Um... Oh, and I have to go to... Um, actually, I was gonna say, let's go to the tower. Let's go back to Leiden and talk to the, uh, talk to the chef. I have a feeling that there might be something that keeps us from either entering the tower or we'll get to the tower and there won't be 
a thing to do because we didn't activate the thing that tells us that we have to go to the tower, you know? So we might get to the top and it might just be like blank on the top. It might just be like an empty room or something. And we have to talk to the right person to make the person spawn there that will allow us to make progress. Alright, high magic, sweet. I don't think... Can I buy those in stores yet? I actually don't remember. Okay, there's nothing else here. Okay, so we'll either meet at the... Uh, Oh wait, no, I, I already said that. Uh, let's go to let's go to Leiden. I was gonna say let's meet at the cave, but I just said I wasn't gonna do that. Let's meet back at Leiden, talk to the chef, and um, he's probably gonna maybe he'll send us to that cave, or maybe he'd be like, "There's purple newts only at the tower," so maybe he'll send us to um, to get them because they mentioned purple newts a couple of times. There's gonna be we're gonna have to go fight one, right? It's gonna be like a big fucking ferocious like dragon newt or some shit. It's gonna be like a boss, ain't it? And we're gonna have to kill it or whatever to acquire it. We're not just gonna, like, find it in a treasure chest or something, right? I mean, maybe, I don't know. Uh, but anyway, yeah, thanks for joining me, and we'll see you guys next time, and y'all take care. Bye-bye.